just so stressed. Like, I don't know what to do anymore. Midterms are really, they're really getting my stress levels up there. Me too. I'm getting sick. I have so much homework to do, and studying for midterms is really just so stressful. I just, like, I don't sleep at night, and everything's keeping me up, and I can't handle it all. I don't know what to do. Me too. Oh, hey, guys. I heard you were talking about, like, having any problems this semester. Yeah, yeah there's a lot. A lot to focus on. Well, I heard, I heard of this new app called Calm. Have you guys heard of it before? Yeah. Well, Calm is actually a great app for like, say like a, for a seven day trial, right? You get access to all new songs, motivational speakers that help you with like meditation and sleep. And you even have like sections for like kids. Well, the best part about it for me is that it helps me improve my focus, especially with these many classes. Like, trust me, yeah. mm -hmm. have you, have, like, you guys want to try it out soon? I think we should. Yeah. In the Calm app, there's many different pages that you can go to. Um, here we have the narrator page. You can search by um, the different narrators that are a part of Calm. There's ASMR, there's nap time ones. You can do nonfiction stories that you can listen to. Uh, they have nature that you can listen to. Music tends to be very calming. They have piano sounds, all different types of that. There's even ones for kids and fiction. Um, a lot of the ones are very different and they have um, very good sounds that you can just listen to and calm yourself to. They help ease a lot of stress and tension. There's inner peace, which a lot of them can be either wave sounds or ocean sounds. You can watch videos that look very calming and just are very soothing and soft. Um, here we have some of the, these are all of them bunched together. There's ones that you can just look at to relieve your stress. There are other ones that you listen to while you try and fall asleep. Um, soundscapes, nature melodies, lullabies, all, just all different types of sounds and stories that you can listen to that will really put your mind at ease and kind of help to alleviate any type of stress you may have or anything like that. Um, they can be really beneficial in different aspects of your life and there's really no audience that they target more towards. You can just really use it for whoever, wherever, whenever you want. This is nice because it teaches you how to breathe and being able to control your breathing is very helpful in many different ways. It reduces your stress, it reduces your anxiety and all around it just makes it that much better for yourself. It's really similar to the Calm app. You can do different sessions, listen to bedtime stories, and it really helps with like meditation, relaxation, and falling asleep at night. Yeah, I've seen, that's funny that I've seen different previews and stuff for that now that you mentioned it. And there's, um, there's like a bunch of different variations that you can do of different stories by people who tend to have very calming voices. Mm -hmm. and it, it's definitely something you should check out. Yeah. Here we have the Headspace app. Um, there's a bunch of different stories that you can listen to. There is sleep sounds. There are wind down sounds, which are um, you can use to fall back to sleep or go to sleep in general. Here we have some of the featured ones. A lot of them require subscriptions, but the, the subscription isn't that costly. So it's definitely something that people can look into. But there are ones for taking a break that you can use to sleep, take a break, let go of any effort and just relax to really dive into the weekend. Um, students find the pre-exam ones really helpful because they help prepare you for exams, clear your mind. Here we have some meditation essentials. There's the basics, guided ones, semi-guided, unguided. There's ones for stress and anxiety, which help you manage that. You can let go of it, transform your anger, reframe your loneliness. Other ones are falling asleep and waking up, like we've seen before commonly. Um, restlessness, single meditations for sleeping and waking up. Stuff I think like both that. of these apps are pretty useful overall because they help people manage things that they can't manage on their own. Um, it kind of eliminates the need to go out and see and get help from other people, maybe if you're not comfortable with other stuff. But I know that they're really helpful for me, for me come exam time because it really helps me clear my mind set it at ease, and really start to focus and hone in on things that I need to do. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and found it helpful, and just be sure to be on the lookout for things to come in the future.